Hello all, welcome to the video. In this video, we'll be seeing how to simulate RLC circuit in PSPICE. We'll be doing transient analysis of this RLC circuit. Before showing you how to simulate the circuit in PSPICE, I will show you the quick commands. Uh, in order to draw the circuits, uh, we need to place the parts. So, how to do that? I will tell you some commands. Please note that we use Control G for part browser search view. In this, you can give the part name. Say if, if you want to place a register, just put R. You'll see R here. Then place. If you want to rotate this register, use Control R. Okay, Control R. Okay, you can rotate using Control R, and you can place anywhere. This is the register, and we have also used a current source. So, if you want a current source, use IDC. Okay, this is IDC. Same way, use Control R to rotate the current in any direction you want. This is the current. Also, we have used the switch. As you can see here, we want a switch which will close at time instance t is equal to zero. So, just search switch SW. You can see two here switch sw underscore t close sw underscore t open means it will close at time since t is equal to zero and switch open it will open at time since t is equal to zero okay even we want this the circuit i have used the first one okay we have placed the parts in order to connect them we need to use a wire right so that can be done by using control w if you press Ctrl plus W, you will get a pencil. Just click on the mouse in this way and connect the parts. Oops. Okay, this is simple. And also, we want the ground. For any circuit, we want a ground. So, just place here. I have already used ground, so it came in this drop down list. Okay. So that's how I have done. The circuit is already ready. Now we'll see how to do transient analysis of this given circuit. You can also zoom just oops one minute. You select this part and just click on this zoom in. Okay. As you can see, there are three resistors. R1, R2, R3, all of 10 ohms, and there is also a switch which will close at time instant t is equal to 0. And there is a inductor with inductance 15 milli, and also there is a current source of 1.5 amps. In this video, we will be doing the transient analysis of the given circuit. Uh, I have discussed in detail about how this circuit works in my website. Please visit the website uh, before. Like if you do not understand how this circuit works, I have explained in detail. Uh, please watch that. Please uh, visit the site and then you can come back here and watch this simulation in order to understand better. Okay.